All right, everybody. Uh, welcome back. We are starting with part two of working on the uh, fire station here. So I decided to ditch this vehicle um, because, first of all, we're not going to have enough space if we only have two garage doors. So we're ditching that. We're not going to use it anymore. We're just going to rock with this guy and this guy for now. Um, until then, uh, in this uh, part, we're going to continue uh, the walls and everything. So we're going to go ahead and just jump right into that. Um, but yeah, uh, I'd like to uh, see what you guys would like to see uh, more of. More of me building or... <clears throat> I don't know, really. But, but yeah. I'm mainly curious if you guys would like to see more building videos or if you guys would like to see more tours or maybe unboxings of different sets I get. Uh, I'm planning on doing a little haul video anyway. Uh, not right now, but soon I'm going to grab, uh, if I can, some more street, street plates and I'm going to grab... Uh, some regular green base plates and blue and if I can find tan anywhere too because uh, I do want to do a little ocean section or some sorts uh, sometime in the near future so you know with the new base plates coming out and everything uh, not sure if Lego's ditching the old ones or anything like these flat ones and my city's mostly all that so I would like to uh, have those still and be able to use them for now before I do end up switching over at one point. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and knock out these uh, little bit of walls. I don't want to bore you guys uh, with me building completely all this. I can't find those little, those little uh, one by three corner pieces. I can never seem to find them. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and knock out this section, and then we'll come back to uh, work on the garage door area. We're going to be mounting these up there, because uh, I did find both of these, so I got them. We're going to do right here in the front over each one. And we're actually going to be swapping these doors out. Uh, we're going to use these like little uh, retro kind of doors and windows. Not like retro, but... Uh, the uh, older style, because I like them, and they were in the old fire station, so I want to leave it like, you know, this used to be like an older built room, and they remodeled the front or something. Alright, I jumped around, jumped around a little bit here, uh, so I got most of it done here, and I started to get to here, uh, which I am thinking, let's see, so we got... The number one and two. So here are our options. And I'm trying to decide between up or down. And I think I like this way better because then it's kind of more right up against this here. Yeah, I think that looks way nicer. But we're going to toss in the garage doors before I finish this off. So that can come off as one piece then. Nice, and let's see, that will fit perfect there. So look at that. That's, that's oh sorry, over here. <laughs> so that's good there. And let's toss these garage doors in then, since we finally got that. Uh, for now we're just gonna have to deal with, like you see how it's like a little, those ones are really scratched. I'm gonna get some more, but for now, that would have to do. Okay, okay, that's lined up, and then just scooch this one over too, and boom. Okay, now we're all set on that. We can go ahead and pop that right into place. All right, oh, it's starting to come together. You know what I just realized too? I should have centered this. <laughs> It's it's fine. Uh, I think it's fine. 
Oh wait, no, we did center it. Oh yeah, we centered it with the uh, the base plate. I'd like to see how that lines up. How does that line up now here? Look at that. Perfect. So that's perfect then for them. Oh, that's going to look awesome. And then I'm going to tile all this in. I'm going to tile all this, tile all that. Put a tile layer here. That will be in our probably third part, finishing up, uh, doing all the little details. But, um, yeah, now I can finish cleaning up this. And I, I realized, too, if we take a look here, this fire truck uh, might not clear that garage door. Oh, it does. It's just if it was down a little bit more, it wouldn't. But I'm thinking just ditch the ladders altogether on the fire truck and just put them in here, say, in case they need it or they don't need it for a... But I think it would look better just sitting in there probably without the uh, stuff. And I think I'll put this one over here and then like this little one over here. Whoa. Hey, where does this tape come from? <laughs> and then, yeah. This top just keeps on falling off. I, yeah, I think that'll look better. You guys can see. That'll look way nicer. Let's look at it from the garage door, too. Yeah, that looks cooler. I was like, this is like their main vehicle, obviously. And then, like, number two is, like, they're all terrain. You know, once in a while. Or in the winter time, you know. Gotta plow through those. All right, so I'm gonna bring this up uh, one, two, three more bricks, uh, just so then we can fit these ladders in and stuff, eh? We'll get it. We'll get it going. And then we got like a bunch of other junk, and we can get this couch in here somewhere. And we'll start accessorizing it. All right, so I got the building part finished. Uh, we're gonna head and ditch the cars here and close those all right so I lied we're gonna work on uh, the tiling and stuff now so bust back out our thing of red tiles and we're gonna tile um, all these in here so all these loose studs we're just gonna tile make it make it a cleaner look all right so we're gonna go ahead and tile all this let me grab these from here. And just lay down some towel. Sounds good to me. And then everything just has like a more nicer finished look in the inside for the most part. Let's go ahead with double pieces here. It'll hold those together nice too. So that works out good. And uh, hopefully we have enough to, yeah, we should have enough to do the uh, whole outside. I'm unsure though. Aha, you get another one. All right, perfect. Now the inside's tiled. Go ahead and do the rest of this. Let's see. And we ended up with another one by one. How did that work out? Oh. Okay, I did have one more. Alright there. Sorry, you guys were kind of out of the shot there. Alright. Look at that. And we are finished with the tiling part here at least so how's it look we got this side we got this looks pretty good pretty happy with this downsize plus we got the two garage doors now with the nice numbers I never had the numbers on there with a nice front big window we still got the my favorite little doorway section here 
Awesome, awesome, awesome. We've got this little nook here. I don't know what we can put there. Now that might be able to be uh, some ladder storage right there, actually. Oh, would you look at that? Oh, we're still not high enough, though, here. All right, they're going to have to be laid down in the corner over there or something. All right, so let's go ahead and get started with uh, furnishing. All right, we're going to go ahead and start with this front section here. And we're going to set up... Um, like a little front desk here. Let me just see where I can position it. Great. We can do like about right there. So when they walk in, they can come right over to the little front desk area. And then, all right, brown chairs. We're going for brown chairs. I got red ones, but I think brown would be like a little wood chair then. All right, so we got one for there, and we got the little chief on a black chair already, but we're going to throw them on a brown to match the other one. And we'll put him in his office in a second, but... All right, so then that's that for now. And then we're going to move over to right here, and we're going to do the TV on the wall here there and we're gonna do our little couch right here put one back right there it's a little cramped it's gonna be just a nice little cozy fire station here and we're gonna go ahead and put the uh, bunk beds right there just in case they got to spend the night there. <clears throat> and then, go and switch this up here. Ooh. Okay, if we're in the chief's office here, we're going to go ahead and throw him wherever that landed. Actually, we'll move him one back. Kind of do it blindly. All right, and there we go. Then we got them. Yeah, I'll pick you guys up. We got them set, sit in there like that. Then, all right, we got that like that. And then we got uh, nothing over there yet. But we got the bunk beds. All right, this area spot I'm gonna use for all of the accessories and stuff. Even though we have the window there, how does that look with the window? So that's kind of our spot right now. Yeah, it looks good. We'll put that. We'll put that big one right there. This one that's connected here. All right, that's sort of in there. And then we're gonna swap back around to this side, so we can put this one right there. And then. We're gonna put the fridge, slide it right in between there, so they can have some drinks and food in there. And for this little fire hose, I'm not sure where I wanted to put it. But we can add that on the top of there for now. If you guys can see that, I can't really take that out, but right up here. Above the, uh, right above that. That looks pretty good, actually. You guys can see there. And then, uh, I'll put a firefighter guy over here drinking some coffee, looking at the TV there. We can just put him at the computer desk over here, doing a little paperwork or something. using the uh, computer uh, that fell off yeah it's gonna keep falling off that's fine I'll just ditch it all right sorry about the bad viewing angles for this whole video uh, trying to get a little better at this um, and then here we can do uh, the little mailbox for here for the fireman's mail and their stuff they get in 
And we can do our little newspaper stand off to the side here. So people can come here and grab a newspaper. All right. So it's pretty much fully furnished now uh, to the point that that's going to be it. That's going to be it inside there for now. Um, I'm happy with that. All that other stuff can find a new home. <laughs> but yeah, that looks good so far. Um, yeah, I think we're going to call it here. But yeah, just before we go, though, we'll throw this guy in here. How does that line up? Oh, we're going to have to do him in slot two because he hits the couch. All right, slot two. Okay, that works out good. It's just like right up against the door. And then we'll do this guy in one. He's the chief's car. Well, that like sits right against the couch too. It'll be fine. Let me give you guys a little look there then. At least. So there we go. Alright, I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.